This is a 1981. You can tell by the serial over here on the side. I won't bore you with that. So this, this old engine just might have points. And if it does, we'll convert it to uh, electronic ignition at the same time. We don't have any spark. So I'll just show you that, and then we'll get to plan B on the spark. Now you may or may not see this. The throttle is turned off. Right here, there's no spark at all. And even when I take my glove off and I pull it, I'll ground myself to a bolt here, I can just feel a slight tingle. And that should be making me jump a foot high. So there's just a slight slight tingle there. That might even, you know, they're usually in the thousands of volts, and I don't think that's a hundred and some volts. So the next trick is to get this housing off. Okay guys, we have the cover off the motor. There was just three bolts. One, two, and three on this side right there. And the cover came off with the rewind. Excuse me, I gotta move you. And I'm looking at this coil and the wire to kill the spark is coming from underneath the flywheel. So that means that this old engine has points. On the newer coils, this is the one that actually came off the six and a half horsepower, telling me that they're in the same family of motor because it's all about the circumference of the flywheel right there. This will go right there. And this this doesn't have the added electronics that this one does. You'll see that there's a little bit fatter. So I'm going to take this coil off, put the new one on, and I'll do a quick demo on, on that when we're there. Okay? We're going to take the screen off. Quarter inch nut driver. And then we'll get the oil filter wrench and spin this off. That should do it. Okay, plan B. It's not over yet. We gotta get the, pl the flywheel off now. Just like that. And the points are in here. Cover. I left the wires siliconed in and cut them off above the silicone so that there'd be a, this would stay dry. Okay, I'm going to turn you off and we're going to, I'm going to clean this up because this, uh, it's actual ratchet that holds on the flywheel. Okay, Tibbs, might as well 
do this too. Uh, this is a, a ratchet, and as you pull the rope, it goes one way, and you can tell it's dry and kind of crunchy. There's probably six ball bearings in here, and uh, the shaft on the motor will polish it up, and then there's a felt pad inside here. We'll add some oil, and it'll oil itself. I'm going to clean this up with a file a little bit too, because it's a little crunched from taking it off. It's been taken off more than once, but these are a maintenance item. Okay, tubes, this is interesting. This is the little piece of felt that goes into here. And I'm just going to put it, I'm going to blow the gas out of it first. And then it goes back in like that. I will use some kind of a screwdriver to get that in. We'll make sure it goes in. I'm back. You guys see me use two of these little bottles, but one is a 10% mixture of gas and oil. We don't want that. It's called primer. And the other one is just nice 30 weight oil. And I'm going to just put a drop, couple of drops of oil on that felt pad. And now we put the bell bearings back into this, like so. gives it the ratcheting action, and then the lid goes back on. And then I just use the vise to clamp it back together again. Okay, too, so we're just putting the new modern coil in with electronic ignition. And I've got the two screws back in, and we're just setting the uh, the coil gap to the flywheel. I've got the magnets at the top. You can see the, the four aluminum fins is where the magnets are. And we just have to get the uh, part of the shroud back on too. We'll just nestle that in there. And we'll rotate that out. And there's we have the gap set for the coil. And the only other thing I have to do is hook up that little wire to that spring. And that shuts it off when the throttle's closed. So we'll come back after. We'll have the cover back on and we're going to give it a test, I think. So if you'd been laying around for 10 years, you'd be hard to start too. <laughs> 